this is Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Duel King. Welcome back to school, guys. Alright, let me flood mod 14. Alright, what's up, guys? Flood mod 14. And yeah, we're back here with another, another episode of Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Duel Academy. Let me kind of move that a little bit to this way. Okay, I think that looks a little better. Anyway, now let's go talk to Cyrus here. Get your game on, yeah! <laughs> Alright, Sai, let's do it, buddy. Uh, we'll go with heads. Alright. Okay. Let's see, I actually need to move my fan a little bit back. Duel! Okay, Cyrus, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Yeah, I hope you guys are doing pretty good today. Uh, I don't remember what we were last doing in here, but uh, you know what? I've got everything else caught up, so I figure a little bit of, uh, yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. Uh, anyway, I'll go with UFO Turtle. Uh, Trap Hole, I guess, right? Oh, well, that's, you know, at least he took out his own monster, honestly. Uh, what was it? Uh, Metroid, okay. Fair trade, fair trade. I'll end my turn, side. What you got, buddy? I summoned a Kwaiti in attack mode. Alright. Go ahead, side. go ahead. Not bad. Honestly, that's... Ooh, and I have Giant Trinity. Ooh. Okay. Alright, so I, I activate Premature Burial. With this, I can pay 800 points and revive the monster you destroyed last time. Nope, no chain. Alright. And he's got nothing there, so... You know what? We played Premature Burial. Let's not worry about that trap card and also recycle that Premature Burial to our hand. Yeah, pretty cool. Alright, with that, I'll summon the... Uh, we'll go with the XF Cannon, in case he has, like, Snatch Deal, but, uh, yeah. Alright, and the best part about this is Turtle can run into Dequichi and still float, so... Alright, Turtle, go! Rapid Spin! Oh, man, I can't believe you destroyed Dequichi so easily. Yeah! Alright, and I'll use the effect of my Turtle uh, side. This monster, when it's destroyed, well then, I can special summon another fire monster from my deck, and I choose another UFO turtle. All right, now, except cannon, double cannon barrel blast. All right, we're winning the duel, we're winning the duel. Oh, I love this music. Graceful charity. That's a pretty good spell card, Sai. ourselves from Steamroid. Uh, depending on what he attacks, well, he's just going after Turtle, so honestly, I'm fine with that. I'll let him destroy it, and uh, yeah, we'll just get another Turtle. No problem. No problem, Sai. Alright, once again, I'll activate the effect of UFO Turtle. And now it's time for this card to land from outer space. Go, UFO Turtle! he'll set another card face down, just like he did last time, yeah. Because all I did was use Giant Trunade last time, so... Alright, also he drew new three new cards off of Graceful Charity. So... Ah, call the honey. Alright, Sai. Not a problem. Okay. Now, he did draw some new cards, so let's see if we can bait a Magic Jammer here. I don't even have any Earth Monsters on the field. Um... So, and I know this will help his steamroid, but I just want to bait the magic jammer, so go. Guy power. Oh, he doesn't have, uh, he does not have magic jammer. Well, that makes me think that face down is probably like negate attack or something. Um, or it could be, has he played mirror force or discarded it? No. Hmm. Well, let's just attack. Yeah. Alright, so Turtle, go into Dekoichi, just like last time. Yeah, it is, a, a, yeah, yeah, Mirror Force, okay. I played that right then, I played that right. But it's fine, it's fine, because I haven't summoned yet Main Phase 2. Good move, Psy, but I still haven't summoned any monsters. So, I'll summon this monster out. 
mechanical chaser in attack mode. Alright, and with that, I'll actually revive a monster too. So I'll pay 800 points again. Well then, that'll let me revive X-Head Cannon. Yeah, I'm mainly doing this as insurance against like Snatch Deal specifically, so there we go. Alright, Sai, and with that, I'll end my turn. Alright, I figured it was an in attack trap since, uh, yeah, he didn't magic dimmer there, so I guess it could have been seven tools too, but anyway. Go, big core! Oh, sacrifice summoning, huh? Alright, let's see what you're gonna do, Sai. Attacking X Head Cannon, huh? use my trap probably on big core so yeah thousand damage that does hurt though all right and let's see here okay so now he's declaring an attack so I will yes I'll activate this on the damage step side rising energy so by discarding a card well then I boost my monster by 1500 big, big ones Looks like your big core has lost a counter. All right. Yeah, and cool, I finally drew my steamroid. Okay, so what I think I'll do is basically just attack once again. Uh, I know he's already used Mirror Force, so... Oh wait, he's already used Torrential too, so what am I scared of? Go, steamroid. All right. I guess the best thing he could have here would be the gate attack, which honestly would probably win him the duel. But uh, let's see. Oh! attack oh my god Sai oh my god well with that we honestly might have lost but uh, yeah I'm gonna keep trying playing Gaia power might have been my undoing here but uh yeah good stuff Sai good stuff yep well wait 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 let's see but my steamroid still has is it gonna account for steamroids effect oh he did Ooh, I didn't think the AI would be smart enough to do that, but uh, he did. Wow. Nice job, Sai. Nice job. Okay. Well, it looks like we lost this one, guys. Yep. Well, yeah, I guess my mistake here was playing Gaia Power to try to bait the Magic Jammer. That's my bad, guys, but, I mean, can you blame me, though, honestly? <laughs> like, after how many times Magic, uh, Magic Jammer has, you know, gone off in this LP? <laughs> All right, well, we, yep, we lost the stars. You're wide open. Not bad, Sai, not bad at all, bro. I'm impressed. Good job, buddy. Hooray, I won. Man, feels great to beat a duel's higher rank than me. Sorry, I don't mean to gloat. That's cool, Sai. I mean, I mean, most of the time I do beat you, so, yeah, it must feel good to win. Ah, the road of a duelist is a long and treacherous. Let's see if you have the determination to see it through and to defeat my cyber dragon. All right, Zane, let's do it, baby. All right, and we'll go first. Oh, wait, I should have went second. I should have went second. It is Zane, after all. Duel. All right. Gaia power again. Uh, Zane doesn't have too many earth monsters, though. You know, that, that I know of. I don't know. Maybe they changed his deck, much like they changed, uh... You know, Jaden's deck, giving him, like, Spear Dragon on all kind of random stuff. Make no mistake, I am this this. Oh, yeah, you are. And now, I summon Mechanical Chaser in attack mode. Go, Mechanical Chaser. Heh, <laughs> destroy UFO Turtle. Not bad, Zane. But, I'm gonna use the same trick I used against your little brother. When my turtle gets destroyed in battle, well then... Another UFO turtle comes out, or any other fire monster I want. Ah, mechanical chaser of my own, that's cool. Well, we have Gemini Elf, so you know what? Go, Gemini Elf. And you know what? Why not play Gaia Power here? Why not? Makes Gemini Elf stronger than Cyber Dragon. Probably a good idea. Alright, go. Double Twin Attack. Double twin attack? That's a little redundant. <laughs> so, you destroyed my mechanical chaser. Oh well. <laughs> Zane, Zane uh, he act like IDGAF, man. <laughs> He's just like, oh well. <laughs> you know, I'm still gonna win. Make no mistake, I am the best duelist. <laughs> That's kind of weird line, but uh, anyway. Oh, just setting Zane. Okay. Alright. Ooh, and we drew Raigeki. Okay. Um, yeah, I almost forgot I had this in the deck. Uh, can we win this turn? I could if we had limiter removal, 
but as it stands, let me do some math here. 24, we would be 38. Nah, we wouldn't quite win. All right, I'll just attack. Uh, I have no idea what his defenses would be like. Because uh, I hardly ever see him on the defensive. So, UFO turtle go. Oh, well, okay, okay. All right, all right. So, just like everybody else, Zane has Penguin Soldier 2. So, all right, all right, Zane, all right. I guess I should have used uh, Raigeki there, but yeah, it's okay, it's okay. Ah, this is the perfect spell card. I activate Power Bond. Uh oh. We might have just lost. May as well get this over with. I fusion summon the Cyber Twin Dragon, and now its points are doubled. I also summon Gyroid in attack mode. Go, Twin Evolution Burst. <laughs> and my Cyber Dragon has two heads, meaning it can attack twice. Oh, crap. Man. Well, well, I can't believe... Huh. What's really weird is he didn't... Uh, I mean, clearly we lost, though, but <laughs> that was a fine dual flood. But what was really weird is he never special summoned Cyber Dragon with its own effect. Because he didn't like Pot of Greed or anything, right? No, he didn't, so... Weird. Yeah, so he must have just not special summoned, and, um... Huh. And it held on to his Cyber Dragons. Kind of a good strategy, honestly, because I didn't think he had any at all. Uh, based on the fact that he wasn't special summoning any of them, yeah. But uh, anyway, uh, it is the weekend now. I'm just seeing if Chaz is around. Oh, I'm sorry, the Chaz. Uh, wow. So yeah, we lost two duels back to back there. Can't, re not really surprised we lost to Zane though. Um, I guess we'll head to the shop and take a look at some of the weekend packs. I guess. Uh, yeah. Come on in. Hey, Sadie. What's up? All right. So let's take a look. Let's buy a few Pyrogen. Of these. I'm only going to start buying like uh, two or three. Uh, no, I'm only going to start buying like two of Moby's pack per weekend. Uh, live vehicles. Um, yeah, sure. We'll take a couple of those. And fusions. Okay. Yeah, we'll buy like five of that. Uh, a couple of clips. I don't, I haven't bought too many of the field cards, but no, no, no. Yeah, we're actually still short a lot in the effect monster, so I'll buy three of those. And then Wait, the machines? This hasn't always been here, right? Ooh, new pack. Okay, so let's actually back out of some of these. Ooh, new pack, new pack. I almost missed that one. Okay, um, yeah, new pack, new pack. All right, so yeah, let's see what all's in the machines. Yeah, interesting. So let's buy like five of this. Okay, yeah, let's, let's check out. Maybe we'll be able to upgrade our machine deck. Sweet. Uh, Mooka Book is good. Uh, <laughs> Potion again. Dragon Seeker. Oh, uh, Dimensional Warrior is good. Uh, another Ring One Soldier. Uh, is that Dark Magician Girl? I don't think we've had, got that before. Okay, might be a new card out of there. Uh, fusions. Uh, in general, I don't have a lot of fusions, so Fusion Gate's good. Thousand Dragons good. Skull Knight's good. Uh, yeah, another Skull Knight. The Curry Box is good. Uh, yeah, Gale Dogger's good. Uh, Manning Black Shark's good. Chimera is good. Fusion Gates, sweet. Okay. All right, let's see if we can get out of machines. Gradius, a spell canceler. Okay. Uh, why is he tank uh, dragon? Uh, Gear Golem, the Moving Fortress. Nice. Dralago, Metal Morph. Ooh, good cards. Um, big Core, Robotic Knight, System Down. System Down would be really funny. You can say Blowback Dragon. Nice, 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 nice. All right, so. Yeah, I got uh, Muka Muka is apparently new. Okay, that's good. Okay, and that's probably all that's new out of here. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, what's new out of the fusion pack? Yes, yeah, Skull Knight, Yeldabra, uh, Bakori Box is new. Nice. Uh, Carbonala Warrior. Okay. And out of here, yep, yeah, everything should still be new. Blowback Dragon is really good. I, I love Blowback Dragon, so check this card out. Uh, yeah, toss a coin three times. If at least two of the results are heads, select a card on your opponent's field and destroy it. Yeah, this is pretty good. It can be used uh, once per turn. So, yeah, pretty cool. All right. 
uh, Cybersaurus. Oh, this is uh, our, uh, you know, dual spirit from uh, <laughs> Duels of the Roses. I mean, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories. Blast Juggler, plus two and a King Rex. Uh, pretty cool, pretty cool. Cyber Falcon. Uh, some of these uh, machines in general are better than some of the ones we have now. Uh, XYZ Dragon Cannon. So I noticed some of the XYZ piece uh, fusions are here. So I wonder if uh, like we can get Y Dragon Head or um, Z Metal Tank. So you know what? Let's buy a little more of the machines. Because I think this is only available on the weekend. So you know what? Let's, uh, let's load up while we're here. So let's get... Let's, you know what, screw it, let's get six more. Yeah, I'm sure, Sadie, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm hoping we get some white, oh, Cyber Dragon, let's go. Okay, this was worth the money. All right, Ancient Gear Soldier as well. Uh, yellow Gadget, ooh, the gadgets, ooh, that could be good. Cyber Twin Dragon, oh, sweet, sweet. Oh, I'm excited now, guys. Now we know where to get Cyber Dragon, oh, yeah. Uh, Kinetic Soldier's interesting as well, Battery Charger. Okay, so we got Cyber Twin Dragon, and we got our first Cyber Dragon. All right, I guess we unlock this pack for defeating Zane. I don't know, or may maybe it just unlocks at this point of the game. Uh, anyway, Ancient Gear Beast and Soldier are pretty good. Beast is honestly pretty good in this game, probably, uh, because a lot of people have like cannon soldiers. Uh, Sai has Dekoichi, you know, uh, Chumley has Nimmo Monga. A lot of stuff that floats and or messes with your board, like Penguin Soldier. So, yeah. Um, Beast, whenever it destroys a monster in battle, uh, its effects are negated. Also, like stuff like Mirror Force won't work because it has the standard ancient gear effect. So, honestly, I might start putting Beast in a lot of my decks. Um, uh, nope, that's it, Sadie. All right, thank you. Okay, so let's definitely save here. And um, usually I don't deck edit in the episode, but I am just gonna add uh, two cards real quick. Uh, Cyber Dragon and Blowback Dragon, I think are pretty good uh, here in our machine deck. So yeah, hopefully I can find them quickly, but uh, yeah, pretty exciting to get some of those new cards there. So let's look carefully here for Cyber Dragon and Blowback Dragon. Um, did I get any more Cannon Soldier? No. Yeah, I'd love more Cannon Soldier too, but uh, anyway, Cyber Dragon, Blowback Dragon. Let's see, Gear Golem's also, you know, a lot better than some of the other stuff I have in my deck as far as defending goes, so we'll add that. Plus, like, I have Giant Rat in, so I can float into it, which is really good. Um, Cyber Dragon, Blowback Dragon, Cyber Dragon, riding some Machine Dragons, oh yeah. Uh, let's see, and I'll edit my deck in between episodes to uh, account for the cards I'm adding here. But uh, yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Cyber Dragon, haven't seen it yet. It is an effect monster, so should be in here. Uh, Drilago's also, you know, pretty cool. Sometimes the direct attack effect might come up, so I'll go ahead and add that as well. Um, yeah, it's, other than that, it's pretty solid with 1600 attack, you know. So, um, oh yeah, an Ancient Gear Beast. I don't know if we passed Ancient Gear Beast yet or not, but uh, if I see that, I'll add it. Okay, there's Blowback, okay. And then Cyber Dragon, Cyber Dragon, and uh, Ancient Gear Beast. I might have skipped, oh, okay, there's Ancient Gear Beast, sweet. I did not skip it. Also, Ancient Gear Soldier might be a good idea for the same reason I said Beast, you know just to avoid Mirror Force and try to get the times two bonus. It's honestly probably a good idea. Um, there's Cyber Dragon, okay. And, and we'll call it good with that for now. We'll call it good with that. Okay, so let's save those changes. And I'll edit the deck between episodes, but for now, let's see if Chaz, the Chaz is around. Uh, there's Zane, we will duel him if we can't find uh, anyone else. Because uh, we haven't dueled Zane, there's Chaz, okay. All right, Chaz, bring it on. I let me do a show like you. I'm Chaz Princeton. Yeah, let's go, bro. Uh, let's see. All right, yeah, I think I have like about. Uh, this will probably be the last duel of the episode, actually. Uh, let's go first. All right. Nice. I'm glad we got our first Cyber Dragon. That's awesome. Uh, let's see. We got X Head Cannon. Uh, I think we'll go with that. Yeah. Attack mode. And I'll set. Uh, it's funny. This is actually. You know, basically one of uh, Chad's signature cards, you know, until he gets the armed dragon level monsters, you know? Ah, hope you're ready for your worst nightmare, I right, draw. Alright, Chaz. Ah, graceful charity will send you running home to mommy. Alright. 
what else she has. She's probably going to set a bunch of Robin zombies and stuff. That's his usual strategy. All right. I draw. Ooh, right, Icky, sweet. Um, oh, he didn't play cards right away. Okay. He usually does. Uh, Shadow Ball, Gaga Gigo. I'm surprised he has Shadow Ball in this game. That's interesting. Anyway, you got a couple of nice face down there, Chaz. It'd be a shame if something happened to him. So, I'll tribute XF Cannon to summon the one and only Mobius the Frost Monarch. And this, this monster's got a special icy touch because whenever he's summoned, well then, I can instantly frost over two of your back row cards, whether they're spells or traps. So say goodbye to your torrential tribute and trap hole. Now go, Mobius the Frost Monarch. Let's give that monster a chill. All right, time to chill out, clown zombie. All right, nice turn for us. Um, I guess I should have played Fairy Meteor Crush there, um, but it's okay, it's okay. I'll play it next turn. Yeah, that would have done 2,400 damage, actually, that's funny. What you got, Chaz? Ah, I'll set two face downs and I'll end my turn. But you just lose already? I'll make sure you won't survive the next turn. Is that so, Chaz? All right, I draw. Ah, you're just wasting your cards. Robin Zombie. There it is. Okay. Yeah, and I'm not too afraid of that, Chaz. So, to start my turn, I'll activate Fairy Meteor Crush. This, mo this uh, gives my Mobius the power to crush meteors, meaning your defenses are no longer helpful, and he'll do damage equal to the difference between his attack points and your defense points. Now, summon Turoroi. All right, go Mobius. Super sharp, piercing freeze. Oh, it's Hain Hain. But hey, if you bounce Mobius, that just means I get to use this effect again. Right, Chaz? Ah, good move. He avoided some damage and he didn't let me use Mobius again. So you know what? I respect it, Chaz. I respect it. Good move. Oh, sorry. All right, what you got, Chaz? Defending, huh? All right. Ah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, don't you just lose already? <laughs> Bro, you just said that. What's wrong with you? Ah, gear golem. Okay. All right. I'll summon back Drill Roy in attack mode, Chaz. All right. Now it's time for, again, a super sharp piercing freeze. Go, Mobius, attack. Oh, this is going to hurt, bro. a lot of damage. All right, Chaz, better make a power play. Ah, don't get cocky. I finished me off yet. All right, whatever you say, Chaz, I end my turn. All right, and the main reason we're fighting Chaz on the weekend is because Ember Cyrus was like, yeah, if you keep beating the blues, uh, Crowler might get mad and do something. So I w basically, whenever a character tells you not to do something, you go ahead and do it, you know, because I'm curious to see what's going to happen. Uh, anyway, I summon Steam Droid. All right, and now, Chaz, it's time to crush your life points. Go, Mobius. Super sharp. Frost Glacian Freeze. Uh, okay. Sweet. So he's going to be barely hanging on. So at this point, we'll use uh, yeah, 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 yeah. we'll use Rush Recklessly to do you know just extra damage, as per usual. And we'll put it on Steamroid. All right, Steamroid, give his life points a trucking. Choo choo. This win can win. Game over. All right, and let's see what we get here. Ooh, 496. Not bad, not bad. So maybe we can get a couple more of those machine packs. Ah, I lost. Me lose. I'll get you next time, Flood. You better believe it. All right, and it's nighttime now, so I think what we'll do is save here, guys. All right, and with that, we are going to... This is going to be the end of the episode. All right, thank you guys for joining me. And uh, yeah, next time on Yu-Gi-Oh! GX uh, Duel Academy, we'll keep uh, dueling a few of the different people. We haven't really dueled here on the weekend, like Chaz, Zane, Alexis, potentially, and um, yeah, uh, other characters, like uh, some of the teachers, like uh, Professor Fontaine and uh, Banner. All right, bye-bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Do, 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 do.